About a year and a half ago, I made a video about the size of the universe on a channel called Halfway Dream. Today, I'm gonna talk about a similar topic, but this time concerning our solar system, as I have always been fascinated with other YouTubers' works. The diameter of the solar system is 287 billion kilometers across. However, I will only talk about the distance between our star, the Sun, and the dwarf planet, Pluto, which is about 6 billion kilometers. In order to grasp this huge distance, I will visualize it as if it is just one kilometer. With that being said, if the Sun is right here, Pluto would be right there. The diameter of our Sun is more than 1 million kilometers across, and it can fit 109 Earths lined up. The Sun here would be the size of a soccer ball. To reach the first planet Mercury, we will walk 10 meters. Mercury is a small planet, which would be here as small as grape seed. The next planet is Venus, which would be the size of a peppercorn. Venus is the hottest planet and it rotates clockwise unlike the rest of the planets. One day on Venus equals 243 days on Earth. After walking for 7 meters, we finally reach Earth, which is a little bigger than Venus. It will be represented as the size of a peppercorn as well. As you can see now, the Sun is getting smaller and all the planets look so dim from this distance. Now we've reached Mars, which could be our future planet. Mars is much smaller than planet Earth, thus it will be the size of a grape seed. After walking for 92 meters, now we arrive at the biggest planet in our solar system, Jupiter. Since it is a giant planet, it would be as small as a fig in this model. When seen in the night sky, it appears like a star. If you have a telescope, you can even see its moons. The next planet is Saturn, which is the second largest planet. It will be the size of a grape. After walking for a long distance, now we are at Uranus, which would be the size of a peanut. Neptune is the next planet that is 271 meters away from Uranus and it would be the size of a peanut as well. We're finally approaching Pluto at the top of the hill. In 2006, Pluto was downgraded from being a conventional planet to a dwarf planet for many reasons. Pluto is smaller than our moon. This is the best picture of the planet we had until the New Horizons probe reached Pluto in 2015. Pluto, from this distance in our model, would be smaller than a grape seed. 